the uh, the standard was fantastic, and we loved so many things in the show. This one we definitely all agreed on, um, and it was because it encapsulated the moment, the year we were in. Um, it was funny, it was humorous, it was done with great technical skill. Um, time had clearly been spent on rorting this thing uh, into 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 reality. Um, and um, it was a, it was a great symbiosis of the super contemporary in the now, and the tradition of craft as well. Um, so um, I, I think we were all thoroughly in agreement that the um, the judges' prize, which is a thousand pounds, goes to Emily Grimble. So congratulations, Emily. Oh, thank well you done. So much. Thank you so so much. It's um yeah, it's so lovely to hear your comments on the work. I think that. It's obviously that everything, sort of the work was channeling the sort of mix of emotions we were all experiencing and it was a way of processing those thoughts. So I think it's amazing to hear how it did connect to the audience as, as you have said that it has. And I think, as Leslie said, you know, the arts have been really devastated in the last year. So things such as this and open calls are so important in terms of getting our work seen and and continuing the conversations so thank you thank you thank you so much I'm so I'm so so happy and um and yeah I suppose I'll just say a little bit about the work as well so it's titled C19 text talk and it's um uh I refer to it as a hand embroidered diary um, and it was created over a period of 100 days since the start of the UK lockdown last year. Um, so basically, you know, I was, as we all were, absorbing a lot of information, processing that information, and I, I created a series of embroideries which uh, are a response to that. So some are directly from the media, some are, uh, you know, my own personal responses to the situation, some are government guidelines, and sort of, you know, reappropriating them with you know with a traditional uh you know craft technique but in a more contemporary way as well um yeah i think <laughs> i'm trying to think about if anything else um but yeah i'm just i'm just so so grateful and i think that it it really was a sort of a bit of a labor of love um over a few months so it's great to to have it seen you know even virtually um and and to know that you enjoyed it thank you emily yeah it definitely came across as a labor of love <laughs> Ha <laughs>